So today we are in our Brentmere Holiday Lodge. It's a technically 36 by 20 two bed lodge, um, but that includes the uh, fitted front deck and veranda, which I will show you in a minute. But internally it's more like a sort of 30 to 32 by 20. So that will be two 10 foot halves. As people often ask how they're transported. Two 10 foot halves uh, for transport. And then when it arrives with you on site, it will then be put back together again to make it into 20 foot wide. So furniture is always um, stays behind for people if they want it to stay or we can take it out if you've got your own furniture because you're moving from a property and don't want to put that into storage or something, we can always take the furniture out. So the, the lodge has got double glazing and gas central heating. Lounge here, as you say, it's a nice size, it's got an electric fire and a really solid hearth built around it, which you don't often get in caravans, or lodges, sorry. Uh, we've got brand new carpets throughout and grey vinyl as well, which is nice, really updates the caravan. Quite heavy curtains in here, as you can see, um, with the frills around the top. You could change those to something different, but um, they're quite nice for the winter, but they are quite heavy, do sort of block a bit of the light. Coming around to this size, as you can see, we've got a dining table and four chairs. You could fit a bit of bigger table and chairs there if you wanted to. Um, we've got another external door, so we've got one out the side there. And then we've got one um, in through the front, which we'll go out in a minute. Our kitchen here, um, this unit on the left is slightly wonky, um, just where it's moved a bit over the years, but uh, nothing wrong with it. Uh, we've got uh, space there on the left, um, just to show you. You could put, because there's plumbing there, you could put a dishwasher there or a washing machine. So there's the option for that. We've got lots of cupboard units, uh, drawers, cupboard doors everything and then on our right we do have a fridge freezer as well integrated gas oven there plate rack so that's our kitchen our dining area and our living area so then we're going to step down through the hallway here so there's a door um, which separates off our hallway and um, living area, so living area to the bedroom, sorry, which is nice. So we're going to step to the back of the caravan lodge, um, and on the left hand side, we've got our main bedroom, which has got um, a double bed in here. You could get a much bigger bed in here if you wanted to. Got a window on our side with a, a really good size radiator. Plenty of storage in here, as you can see, we've got cupboard units as well as drawer units below, and then a mirror vanity desk unit there. We've also got an additional cupboard unit there which you could easily use for uh, you know, a telly on top or even a telly inside. If you wanted to there's a TV aerial point in there so it's designed to have a hidden telly. Uh, we've got an ensuite in here. So there's an ensuite shower room so we've got a basin and we've got a toilet and then spinning around we've got a corner shower unit as well. That's really handy to have. Stepping out of there and turning round to our hallway area and then go to the other side at the back of the lodge here where we've got our twin bedroom. So two singles in here at the moment but as you can see it's a wide room so you could easily fit a double or, or even bigger uh, bed in here. Spinning round, this one's got a window on the back of the lodge and then we've got good size hanging space there Again, vanity unit, drawers and mirror. A couple of cupboards in the hallway for the boiler and some storage. And then on our left here, we've got the bathroom. So bath and sink and toilet. So we've got the ensuite with the shower, sink and toilet. And then we've got another bath here, uh, bathroom with the bath, sink and toilet. I have seen in the past, I did see somebody who had removed this bath and aqua board and everything fitted a shower in the corner and then they'd used space to the side um, for utility with a, a stacked sort of tumble dryer and washing machine that's always an option if you wanted to do a bit of DIY um, you have got the shower in the ensuite um, but it depends if you want a bath really 
but it's a good size room if you wanted to sort of change it around and do something with it. So stepping then back through the hallway, we're going to go outside. And see our integrated front deck. So it needs a bit of a wash off, it's a bit green, the plastic, but you've got this nice covered decking area, as you can see. So as we know, sometimes our summers can be a little bit wet, but you've got a nice area here where you could sit out in the evening with a glass of wine and be under cover even if it's still a bit drizzly but warm. Spinning round to show you the size of it. So it goes the full width of the lodge, so 20, 20 foot um, across. And that's what I'm saying, so it's a 36 by 20 lodge in total, but that includes this front deck and canopy over the top which is all integrated into the chassis so it doesn't come off. <coughs> So it does need a wash, please bear that in mind. Get that done next week. But walking around, you've got full guttering and downpipes. And the cladding on the outside is plastic with a texture to it. Show you here, so a good bit of give in the, in the plastic. Just drop down underneath and show you the chassis. So as you can see, it's not galvanized, but it's a solid chassis, solid metal there, which isn't going anywhere. There's our side door, as I mentioned when we were in the kitchen. So as I say, it's a 36 by 20, two bedroom, Brentmere Holiday Lodge. It's holiday home insulation rather than residential, but it does have double glazing and gas central heating. It's 36 foot by 20 foot, 36 long, 20 foot wide, splits into two 10 foot halves for delivery. And as I say, that does include the front deck. The skirting around the bottom here is not included because it's only part, not ideal for a lodge really when you're fully sighting it. Um, and then these steps in the front here are also not included, it's just here for uh, getting into the lodge um, but if you needed steps we can provide those as well so yeah until next time thanks